Hey guys, this is my finished build on the Iconic X uh, sport frame. Um, this one is actually for sale. Um, I'm going to just keep building them and, uh, you know, get bored and sell. Um, I've, got, I've got a bunch of them, so I'm always making them. Anyways, here's, here's the aluminum frame. Um, it's my new design. You can see my speed controllers in here. So they're, they're flush on the sides here. You can barely see them. They fit in here perfect. The wire goes through this channel here in the arm, and there's a clear acrylic, uh, actually it's polycarbonate piece on top of the frame in the middle here. And um, if you can see closely, the wires go in the middle. They go through the middle and they come out. And all you have is your four speed wires, speed controller wire. I mean, I'm sorry, your four, uh, yeah, your four speed controller wires and your, your power wire that's already ready to go. Um, it's very clean. I mean, it's a very clean build. Not messy with wires or anything. So all you're doing is just feeding that right to your, your uh, flight control. Um, but you can see how, uh, how nice and clean. There's no motor wires all hanging out everywhere. So you can see it's got a battery uh, strap uh, holder here. <clears throat> so you can put your battery there. Um, you could probably put a piece of Velcro here. It's uh, under under 400 grams. It's about 350 grams right here, which isn't isn't bad at all. Um, it's not even a pound, so it's pretty good. Um, it's using KDA 50S motors, um, and it's also got rubber vibration dampeners, which aren't easy to get. Those are included. Um, it's got your uh, top and lower plate. So this top plate's using. Uh, Two and a half inch uh, risers, spacers on there, uh, but yeah, that's it. It's uh, it's ready to go. Just drop a board in. I'm gonna just just message me for a price if you want to buy it. I'm gonna throw it on eBay. So, all right, Iconic X finished.